My hope is that uh, this mural will inspire people um, to get angry, to get organized, and to get in the way. Hi, my name is Bernie McCass. People um, wonder if there are actual real people depicted in the mural, and the answer is no. They really symbolize the people who organized and began to, to fight the, the inner belt. And those people, for the most part, started with the women who were living in homes on Brooklyn Street and would talk to one another about it. And so every time any kind of news developed, they could share that with each other. And as time went on, it became pretty clear that uh, if the inner belt came through, they would lose their homes. Um, there would be a great deal of displacement. And so they were able to start this whole resistance to the inner belt, um, sort of over the backyard fences, you know, and uh, it's, it was really a grassroots community effort. The scale was just an exaggeration because uh, the underlying message was, you know, you're really much bigger <laughs> than the opposition in, in many ways if you organize. And, in, and the community has, you know, it's, the, it's their homes, it's their life, and that's much more important than just a bureaucratic decision to put a highway through, you know. Um, and so the characters are larger than life. Uh, and what they did, most kind of larger than life, they stopped a highway. 